Dexter Henry here from Madison Square Garden following the holiday festival where the St. John's Red Storm defeated the Fordham Rams 56 to 50. And this was a very interesting game in the fact that St. John's had a 14 point lead in the second half only to see that dwindle down to five as the Fordham Rams fought back in the game. But maybe even the more interesting story is we all know that the St. John's Red Storm are shorthanded and that really showed in this game. Six players played in this ball game five of them logged over 35 minutes. The only player that did not have double figure minutes was Malik Stith off the bench with four points. But the St. John's Red Storm were able to get this victory over the Fordham Rams. It was a much needed victory considering the fact they had not won a basketball game in nearly three weeks. I feel like we just, we needed this one. You know, we played hard. I think we played the hardest we could, even though we could have got some more stops. But I feel like we played hard and we deserve this one. You probably won't feel the fatigue until tomorrow, but I think it's, you know, playing 40 minutes is tough in any situation, especially in college, because, you know, it's, it's intense every play up and down the court. And I, we had five guys over 35 minutes today, and that's just, that's real tough on everybody. That showed a lot about our team, you know. We, um, we showed a lot of toughness and, <coughs> uh, how do you say, persistence, you know. We just kept going and going. Even when we retired, we just kept playing. I mean, everybody makes runs in college, you know. We just did, we just had to. I, th I think we could have did a better job of stopping it early. You know, everybody's gonna have runs in college. That's a college game. I just feel like we we kind of like kind of slowed them down a little bit. You know, we got we just we just weren't making enough shots. There's, there's a lot of guys on that team from New York, so they were all talking junk and stuff like that. Even during the game, we were, we were talking and stuff, and we we won. So I got bragging rights for this season. <laughs> <laughs> so the Johnnies get a much needed victory here, and one of the positives in today's victory was the play of point guard Phil Green. He now has that starting point guard role with Nuruddin Lindsay leaving the team. And he did a good job in this game, four assists, nine points. And players talked after the game about how vocal he was. He was able to settle things down on defense and on offense, telling players where they needed to be and calming them down in tough situations, such as when the Fordham Rams were making their comeback in the second half. One of the other positives for the Johnnies was rebounding. Collectively, they did it as a team, which is what Mike Dunlap talked about after the game. Fordham boasts one of the best rebounders in the country, but Mo Harkless did a tremendous job on the boards with 16 rebounds to go along with his 13 points in this contest. The Johnnies also got 10 points from God's gift to Chua, and D'Angelo Harrison led the way with 15 points. So overall, the Johnnies will look to add more bodies to this team. They can't play with six players for long. It's definitely going to take a toll on them, especially as the Big E schedule comes up. But for now, this is a good win for the Johnnies. They even their record at 5-5 five and five on the season, and they will look to build on that as they continue on. From Madison Square Garden, this is Dexter Henry for Backpack Broadcasting.